I'm Andy Flint, and we're here in Northridge, California at the home of JBL Professional. Eon's been around for almost 20 years, and worldwide we sold almost 2 million units. And so when we looked at how are we going to take the product line forward to the next generation, we wanted to make a truly revolutionary product. And we think the Eon 600 definitely delivers on that. Next to me is the Eon 615. It's a 1,000 watt plastic powered speaker. And there's also two other models, a 12 inch and a 10 inch version, so it's a complete family. And I want to walk you through some of the unique features and functions of this product. The first is the design of the product, and we use the term purposeful design. What that means is everything about the product is the way it was meant to be. We blacked out all the hardware, we blacked out the JBL logo, and the purpose is the speaker should look professional in any setting. The second thing that we did is we put a monitor angle on both sides of the product. So whether you want to use it on the left side, the right side, use it as a stereo pair, it works perfectly. We also have rubber feet, so once you put it in the monitor position, it won't slide around on the stage. We added four handles to the product. So we have one on the left, one on the right, one on the top, and one on the bottom. If you have it in the monitor position, there's always a handle to grab. If you walk by from the top and pick it up, there's always a handle to grab. And it's super convenient to put it on a pole with the top and the bottom handle. The more you interact with it, the more you should appreciate the function of the product. So if you look at the bottom of the product, there's feet that index to the top of the product. That allows you to stack two units on top of themselves. Now, we don't recommend that for use in terms of sound, but what it is useful for is for storing and transporting the product. JBL is known for designing and manufacturing its own components, waveguides, and enclosures, and again, this is no different. So it has a JBL-designed woofer, a JBL-designed compression driver. We have the image control waveguide included, and that's from our LSR 3 Series and our M2 flagship studio monitors. So you get amazing imaging, superb detail on the high frequency, but we took it one step further and we added the pattern control aperture. Working on the uh, on the Eon 615 project was was a lot of fun, and uh, being able to make the the product sound as good as we possibly could make it sound was a challenge, and it was pretty rewarding in the end. What the pattern control aperture does on the Eon 615 product is by pinching in on the sides, it allows that woofer to have. 90 degree coverage, which you, do, you don't get on a 15 inch woofer without an aperture. Being able to, to use a fluted aperture to prevent some of the sound anomalies that can happen if you use like a slot. By using the pattern control aperture that we have on the N615, we're able to, to uh, moderate that pattern on the woofer. So at the crossover frequency, the woofer actually has a 90 by 60 pattern just like the horn does. And what it means is you've got this seamless directivity transition between these two drivers that uh, whether you're on axis, whether you're off axis, you're gonna hear the same thing. You're gonna have intelligibility that you can't get any other way. The waveguide geometry, the uh, image control waveguide that's used on the uh, high frequency driver is the same map that's used on the JBL M2 uh, studio monitor and the other studio monitor products that are coming out of JBL Professional nowadays. And the same results that you get in a studio monitor is the same benefit that it delivers into a portable PA product you can have a portable PA product that sounds really, really good. And as much like a studio monitor as a portable PA product can sound, it does. And, and this is why. We designed the back panel to be as functional and flexible as possible. It's also super easy to use. If we take a look at it, we have two different channels for inputs. So we have an XLR quarter inch input on channel one, which can be mic or line. We also have a quarter inch and XLR input on channel two, which can be mic or line. That way you can plug a mic into either one, you can plug an instrument into either one, uh, or you could do one or the other. So if I was using it for a mic on one channel and an acoustic guitar, let's say, on the other channel, it makes it very flexible uh, to use the system. We also included a through. So this is for daisy chaining speakers. So if you're using it for a monitor and want to daisy chain multiple monitors, simply go in one of the inputs and out the through. Or if you're using it for a mono system or a delay system where you're having multiple speakers in a line, again, it's a quick way to get signal into the speaker and back out of the loudspeaker into additional speakers. We've included input attenuators for each channel. So channel one and channel two have attenuators. And then we have a master volume control. 
So now once you've set the levels of your independent sources, you can now use the master volume just to raise or lower the overall volume of the loudspeaker. We also included some quick EQ presets on the back. We wanted to make sure that the functions that are used all the time can be quickly accessed and quickly recalled via a preset. If I'm using it in the traditional setting where I'm using it on a tripod or on a pole above a subwoofer, I'm gonna use the main tuning. And that's the way that it comes straight out of the box. If I wanna use it in the monitor position for monitors, I simply press the EQ preset button so that the LED next to monitor lights and simply put the speaker on the floor. It's now ready for monitor duty. If I wanna use it with a subwoofer, I hit the EQ preset button again, and now the sub preset's recalled. If I wanna use it for speech reinforcement, I press the EQ preset button again, and now the speech LED is lit. We spent a lot of time thinking about what would add value and make it easy to use, and that was adding the ability to control the DSP in the loudspeaker via Bluetooth. So we included the latest Bluetooth 4.0 low energy technology. That allows you to control the master volume via Bluetooth, that allows you to have a high and a low shelf. And think of that as like a simple EQ. It's like a bass and a treble control in your car. I need more or less bass, or I need more or less treble. It's really quick and simple. The more advanced feature is called EQ Plus. That allows you to control three parametric EQs. You have control over frequency, gain, and Q. This button on the back allows you to bring the EQ in and out. So if I've set some EQ, and I don't have my phone or the application with me quickly, I can run up to the back of the speaker and take it out of the signal chain. Same thing, if I want to turn it back on, I can just quickly hit the button again, and the EQ is back in the signal chain. We also have the ability to recall the presets that are on the back panel. So as we talked about those application presets, those are available in the app as well. We can also add the EQ to those presets and save them as a user preset. So the user can save up to four different presets. Those can even be copied and pasted to other loudspeakers on the network. The application supports iOS and Android devices and allows up to four loudspeakers to be seen on the network. One of the limitations of Bluetooth is that you control one speaker at a time, but we've allowed the app to see the four different devices on the network, making it very quick to get in and out of each speaker. And again, with the ability to save and recall presets and copy and paste them into different loudspeakers, you can get your system up and running quickly. The Eon 600 is truly a revolutionary product. With its clean, professional design, it ensures that you can use it in any application worldwide. With its transducer and waveguide technology, it delivers studio quality sound in a live, portable loudspeaker. And with its Bluetooth control, it ensures that you can get your system up and going quickly and customize the way that you want it. This really is the next step forward in portable PA live speaker technology.